Good afternoon, how are you? Steve Greenhouse, stickinatruck.com. Nice to see you. Today I'm going to be talking about one of my um, bugbears or something that really matters to me. And it's all about business without bullshit, and making money online and the whole fairy tale that is internet marketing. It should be interesting. And maybe you'll understand why I talk about business but without the bullshit. If you're new to the channel, we produce new content every Wednesday. Make sure you don't miss anything. Just hit the subscribe button down there. Ring the notification bell. Give us a like. Maybe leave a comment. Look forward to hearing from you. Okay, be back in a moment. Enjoy the video. Back in 2012, I sustained a really bad shoulder injury at work and I had scheduled surgery due to take place and I had a very specific date for that surgery. I also knew that I would have prolonged recovery without even being able to go into work on what they call light duties. So I determined in that four or five month imposed um, recovery time that I wanted to try and set up some sort of secondary business. Now I had come from a multi-level marketing background. I understood about building teams and I wanted a business that was ethical, didn't exploit other people, wasn't bothered about having to work quite happy to do the work because I think people look at online businesses with a, some sort of hope that they can do this without lots of work um, and that is one of the main pillars of business without bullshit. You've got to roll your sleeves up and do some work. You know opportunities come along and people miss them so often because they come along dressed in work clothes. So I did a lot of research and one thing I would suggest that you don't do is to go to Google, our favorite search engine, and put in the search term, how do I make money online? Your computer will explode with pop-ups and suggestions, some of them scams, some of them genuine, and all these things that people say, oh, that's a scam, that's a scam, that's a scam. Most of them are genuine opportunities. It's just that the people trying to take advantage of them miss the point that work is involved. And for some reason, and it was like this in multi-level marketing, people thought that they could buy a business for £70, do one little meeting, and suddenly they'd be able to buy three houses in different countries of the world, four speedboats, a Jaguar and a Porsche, and never have to do another day's work in your life. Where in anywhere, in anything that is wholly good or proper, is that likely to be the case? It really isn't. If you want to earn a million pounds, you're going to have to be providing value to the worth of a million pounds. Now, there's a guy called Jason Drone, who I used to follow on the internet, who had a wonderful saying, if you want to make a million pounds online, find out how to make a pound, and then do that a million times. And the beauty of the internet is our ability to leverage simple transactions. And suddenly the old time for money thing becomes an irrelevance because we can break the connection between time and money. We can create evergreen products that work whether we're there or not. But establishing those takes work. Now I'm not going to go into how do you make money online today or anything like that. I just want you to be aware that it is possible. But the caveats. Number one, you've got to get good. 
and good stands for get out of debt. If you're going to go into huge debt to start a business, you need to make sure that you're leveraging that debt safely and it's sustainable. Because if you're in a place with fear, because you don't know whether you can maintain or maintain the repayments, just going into debt willy nilly with a blind hope is a suicide journey. And I seriously do not recommend it. As I said earlier, you've got to be prepared to roll up your sleeves and do some work. Anything worth having is worth working for. The beauty of the internet isn't that you don't have to do the work, but that using the internet is giving you huge leverage. The difference is like one man digging a trench with a spade or one man digging a trench with a machine, a steam shovel or a JCB with a backhoe. You know, when people used to build houses and they dug footings, it could take them three weeks to dig the footings out. It's an afternoon's work now with a little digger. A little machine is round and done. Pour the concrete on the same day as you dig it out. And you get your level spot on. That's the same sort of advantage that working online can give you if you do it properly. And finally, you've got to know your own shit. You've got to know your own value. You've got to learn the skills before you can pass them on. And sometimes learning those skills can take a little bit longer than you thought it would. I've invested time and money over the last eight years, building my skill sets, building my brand, building my online reputation. It all takes time. Anybody that tells you different probably isn't lying, but they're stretching the truth. You've got to do some groundwork. Now you can do it quickly or you can do it slowly. And the beauty of the internet is the information is all there. It's very easy to consume. And you can probably get away with doing a degree course in six months because the information is so easy to consume and you can do it quickly and crack on. Or you can take five years or you can take 10 years. It's up to you. You work at your own speed. But if you're working slowly, don't look over the fence to the people next door going, oh, he's done more than me and gotten further than me. I wonder why. Because he's done the fucking work. It's the only reason. It's not because they're smarter, not because you're dumb. He's done the work. Do the work, you get the results. And that's not like the old diet thing where eat less, do more. That's a crock of shit if ever I heard it. But if you do enough of the right work for long enough, you will grow a business. My one thing is telling the truth. I'll tell you how it is. Somebody once said of me, oh, he's the sort of guy that will cut your throat and you'll thank him for it. Because I want you to know the truth. I want you to know what you're getting into. And I'll show you the pitfalls. I'll tell you the cost. Okay? Look forward to seeing you on the other side. If you want any more information, there's a little clickable link in the description of this video. And that'll take you through where you can sign up and meet a business associate of mine that will run you through an opportunity. There's hundreds of them. Okay? You take care. Speak to you soon.